December 22, 2017, Friday of the third week of Advent. A reading from the first book of Samuel. In those days, Hannah brought Samuel with her along with a three-year-old bull, an ephah of flour and a skin of wine, and presented him at the temple of the Lord in Shiloh. After the boy's father had sacrificed the young bull, Hannah, his mother, approached Eli and said, Pardon, my Lord. As you live, my Lord, I am the woman who stood near you here praying to the Lord. I prayed for this child, and the Lord granted my request. Now I in turn give him to the Lord. As long as he lives, he shall be dedicated to the Lord. She left Samuel there. The Word of the Lord. The Responsorial Psalm. The response is, My heart exalts in the Lord, my Savior. My heart exalts in the Lord. My horn is exalted in my God. I have swallowed up my enemies. I rejoice in my victory. My heart exalts in the Lord, my Savior. The bows of the mighty are broken, while the tottering gird on strength. The well-fed hire themselves out for bread, while the hungry batten on spoil. The barren wife bears seven sons, while the mother of many languishes. My heart exalts in the Lord, my Savior. The Lord puts to death and gives life. He casts down to the netherworld. He raises up again. The Lord makes poor and makes rich. He humbles. He also exalts. My heart exalts in the Lord, my Savior. He raises the needy from the dust. From the dung heap he lifts up the poor to seat them with nobles and make a glorious throne their heritage. My heart exalts in the Lord, my Savior. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Mary said, My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God my Savior, for he has looked upon his lowly servant. From this day all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him in every generation. He has shown the strength of his arm and has scattered the proud in their conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things, and the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel, for he remembered his promise of mercy, the promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham and his children forever. Mary remained with Elizabeth about three months and then returned to her home. The Gospel of the Lord. 